what people would read her. And, and I think sometimes when you're out there in the public and you tell people that first, like, <gasps> too violent, too this, too that, and, and, well, here I'm thinking it, it's the truth that people are so afraid to uh, reach that truth, you know, sometimes they would want it, but they don't want to go through the story. And so, um, since you all three articulated so well, how do you answer those who don't really tap into planner? You know, they'll, they, they just stay away or something, and I'm just like, you know, it's hard, you know, I just want to know how you would answer that. That's, that's kind of well, I do answer them all the time. I teach <laughs> Planner O'Connor almost every semester. Mm -hmm. And students, many of them will have that initial reaction, which is not surprising. And in, in fact, I feel it is important to remember when you read the stories. And, and I think a lot of their power for O'Connor, I think she recognized that people would act that way. And that that would repulse some, but it, it's that again, it's that, that grotesque, the push pull, the, the, the proverbial train wreck. You can't not look at it, but you have to, you know, that's what the grotesque is. It's like I'm rejecting it, but I'm also drawn to it at the same time. And that that action, she hoped, would prompt an intellectual response, a curiosity, as well as a visceral response, but to sort of, I've got to go and find out now. That's what she wants. And so, I try to help students to sort of seize on that aspect of the moment. And then I'm like, okay, so if you think about this more, what's going on here? And as we work on it together, then their, their understanding deepens and then their enjoyment also deepens and then they're less resistant. That's my experience in teaching. And they're so unforgettable. You know, well, that's the other thing. Yeah. yeah, well, that's yeah. what she said. One of my favorite things that she said about it, she said, the story is not a story unless it hangs on and expands in the moment. Mm -hmm. And that's the effect that she wanted to have. Well, that goes with what one of y'all said, or maybe all y'all said, about she, as her vision of herself and what she wanted to be as an artist, it was to write and to express, but it was also to get even beyond what she was writing and expressing to the uh, glory of the mystery of God. Mm -hmm. So, you know, it's definitely, you can't read yourself and be neutral. Well, that's what she wanted. She wanted that. That's exactly what she wanted. Yeah. Yeah, 